Today we are going to carry out wireless control between computer and the variable frequency drive via two different modes of DTU. There are two different modes of DTU, EA20 and E90. This is variable frequency drive. Later on, I will use one push button and one breaker with purpose for protecting the VH VFD. This push button I will connect it with forward and common with purpose start and stop VFD and one motor. Now I will start cable connection. Now I will connect it, all the cable for each equipment. First one, E820 DTU. This is power cable. The next one, I will connect variable frequency drive with motor. Make sure here is match U V W. We should match. Now I will use one push button to connect it forward with common. Here should be used normal curves. Here's. 23 port and 24 forward and common secure the cable next I will connect power supply for VFD I will use one breaker now we remain in the last connection e a20 with VFD. The last one. First output of in A20 connected to VFD. Now all cable already connected. Confirm all cable connection is secured. Close the cover. Let's go to recheck the cable connection. Notice. Make sure both deep switches are in down position. Means. Data acquisition mode. Antenna cable is connected. Let's go to VFD. I employ one push button. Connect it forward and come with the purple start and stop. Take care of those two cables. Notice you should. Pay attention to this jumper. Both cable is okay. Plug in power supply. I will not display DTU parameter configuration here. If you forgot how to do it, please watch previous video. I am going to demonstrate how to configure VFD parameter setting. Parameter configuration should be without load for VFD. Switch on the power.
run the simulated software. Select the correct port for E90 data transfer unit. Com8 is for E90 here. Make sure everything is okay. Open the port. Now I will start run the motor. First of all, write one command. Obviously, the motor start running. The analog signal, the range is 4 to 20. Now I will put 12 milliamp in the middle position. Let's see. Speed of motor rising easy. What about the maximum? 24 milliamp. And again. We can see the motor. Now the speed is very fast with noise. Now I'm going to stop the motor. I will put 4 milliamp, means 0 in good. Now motor stop. Now we have the stop. Switch off the power supply. Wait for some time. Power off. Plug off both DTU. Everything is secured. Thank you for watching.